All right, so I'm going to talk about how you do push-ups properly with proper form. And it you might think that you have a good form while doing push-ups, but trust me, I had horrible form for probably like 9, 10 months, and I didn't realize it until I looked at myself doing push-ups and realized I'm not doing it properly. So a lot of people um, fall into this, like I guess, trap where they want to do a lot of push-ups, like 40, 50, 60 push-ups. But they end up getting just terrible form and it's there's no point because you can do 60 push-ups with horrible form, but that's easier than doing 20 push-ups with really good form. So I'm going to explain how you get really good form while doing push-ups. And I want you, I want you to pay close attention to my, um, my forearms here. A lot of people when they do push-ups, they do it like this. Now, that is still technically a push-up, but your arms, uh, my arms, if you noticed, were going like diagonal, and that's not what you want to do while doing push-ups. It ruins the form and barely um, engages the chest. Note the difference now when I do these sort of push-ups, so. Now, this is how you actually have proper form while doing push-ups. You notice how my forearms are completely straight, they're like that, rather than moving like this? That is proper form while doing push-ups. But, basically, it is a lot harder to do it that way um, compared to doing it the, the first way that I showed you, with your arms going like this. Doing that is, I'm sorry this camera is so shaky, but doing that is a lot harder. And that's why people, um, they don't have the humility to do the proper form because you end up doing less reps because it's harder. But at the end of the day, what would you rather have? Would you rather have more reps or would you just have a better physique? I think you'd have a better physique, right? So that's how you do proper form, but I'll show you how you actually do it. So let's say you're not doing ground push-ups and you're doing push-ups on a surface. Right now, pause the video and start doing some push-ups, not on the ground, but on the surface, and notice how your arms move. Most likely, your arms will not go slanting. They will most likely be straight when you do push-ups on an elevated surface, on like, on like a couch, or like on the wall even. But notice when you do it on the floor, your arms start going weird now. Your arms kind of start going diagonal. So, that's why your, your arms are not supposed to go diagonal because it, it, hurts, it hurts your chest less when your arms go diagonal, which causes it easier to get more reps. I could probably do 40, 45 reps with really bad form, but only like 20 with really good form. So that's why you shouldn't focus on reps. You should focus on good form while doing push-ups. And that's probably why I didn't notice much gains while doing push-ups. It's just because I had, had horrible form. So yeah, I, I'd say just record yourself while doing push-ups and make sure that your elbows are kind of like straight on like kind of near your body uh, or like near your chest while doing push-ups and make sure your arms go st like straight down like this instead of like that notice how this my arms going sort of diagonal but while I do this it's straight you want to get into that habit